broke off their rear ends. Get this one to the medical room. Throw the other in the brig and keep them there. Oh, great. Well, I like where I'm going a hell of a lot better. Should just give me my fifty cents. None of this would have happened. Evidently, I'm broke, my guy. You shouldn't have gave me the fifty cents to begin with. Ah, oh, great. Ah, oh, crap. Oh yeah. Hmm. What is that? Ah. Uh... Fuck was that? <laughs> oh no, Alan, don't look behind you. Shut up, Crispin. <laughs> Yeah, don't don't mind him. He's only here for emotional support. Well, ain't this dark? Hey. Hello. Anyone there? That but kid reminds me of Andy Griffiths. Hmm. Hey, what's what's going on over here? There was something. Yeah, there it is. Oh, that's blood. It's gonna be locked, isn't it? Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Oh. What? That's not true. Yeah, just just quit down next to the dude's body. That's perfectly normal. Okay. Okay. I was right. about to clap them all. So, so far, how's the game? Uh, we just started. <laughs> what do you think of it so far now that you barely started? I, I can't say. Literally, first time moving around. Wait, Alan, have you already played it? No, this is my first time playing it. So, you want me to go that way, but what if I want to go this way? Oh, okay, I can't. Don't. Um. Okay, there's not much you can do in here. Oh. Well, all these camera angles are gonna get me. Uh, uh why, why is the floor really red? Howdy, Charlie. How's your time off? Just get me out of here already. What the hell is going on up there? Heard aircraft and gunfire. Me too. And there was a... a corpse. What? In the sick bay. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. I don't right, know if I go, dog. Okay, so that is you. Yeah. Never mind. I thought after yeah. ten days I was already losing it. <laughs> Wait, ten days? <laughs> oh, shit. That's X. Okay. Oh, God.
I'm gonna just one you right now. I'm probably gonna mess up like half of those. Yeah, I almost time missed, events. I almost messed up myself. What the hell? Oh, I didn't mess up on that one, but. Uh. Uh. No, 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 no. What are we looking? No, at? no, no, no. Do you not see the freaking little child like come from the wall? No. Uh, okay, okay. Well, you could. Okay, let's just. Let's just not go. Well, she went. She went through this. I heard like the you know the the kid laugh and then it ran this way. But I I don't know if we uh. No. Well, it's locked. Hold on, I might I have a key. Does oh, my key work on this? No. Okay. Yeah, in the sick bay there was a dead dude. Took his key. Sorry, messed up. It's okay. I wasn't expecting it either. <laughs> Fuck no. Yeah, you said it. Fubar and then some. So that's, I, I don't understand their sayings. Yeah, a little, a little out of touch with the times. Yeah. Hey, this dude had a gun. Can I, can I take his gun? Did he? Yeah, remember he, he had a gun. Like that oh. last scene. I, mean, I, I know he had a gun. Oh. Hmm. You there? We go to the left. Is there a left? No. Ah, okay. Turn around. I don't like the fact that the ground is red. him in the mess hall he was fit as a fiddle poor fucker try saying that we're gonna take his dog tags wow okay <laughs> oh, okay I guess we can't go that way no, both try to do the same thing oh yeah I see the hmm. man these camera angles though oh dude I almost lost something you else. Oh, I'll wait. I'm right here. Oh, okay. Hold L1 to walk faster. Wait, what's done here? Um. Anything? So, uh. Okay. Or are you getting a real strange feeling right now? Uh, it was. Right, like a guy who likes to talk it. about his feelings. <laughs> You look like a mess on wheels, Chuck. Hey, well, that's locked. The only one. Great. Good company. Let's just get up on that. Yeah, fine. Agree. Yeah. Why is it that there's so few uh, military personnel on this boat? Maybe something happened, or I I don't know. Oh. Hey, Chuck. You see that kid over there? Uh. No. You feeling all right? Oh great! I'm the. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, I'm this I... one. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. I'm so glad that, they, that you mentioned it. <laughs> huh. Wow. Okay. Alright. See, I might be delusional, but at least I got the gun. You took. Oh man, you're gonna waste so many bullets. Oh, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> that's fine. At least 
Well, if we're next to each other, say, do you see the thing? And if it's not there... You're then. just getting attacked by nothing? This seems reminiscent of that video you sent me. I'm just saying, out of those, like, five dead soldiers, you're telling me that only one of them had a gun? Uh, yeah, you know. What the hell? What? Jolly, where you at? What happened to you? What happened to you? Uh, I'm gonna go over here. Uh, I'm in a cutscene and I'm hearing a little child. I see a child. Oh, I it's my child, isn't it? I don't see you. I see a dead you. What's my child do? A dead me? Like, you're cut open. But like, you're I'm very much name. so alive. I'm shooting my gun right now. <laughs> Can can you not? Like actually? Oh, is that all? Oh my god, I love this game so much. <laughs> yeah, my dude just had like a heart attack. <laughs> I'm not even joking. You wanna know what you did? Uh, you shot me. Huh. Uh, <laughs> The moment you said I'm shooting my gun right now, I'm getting shot at. <laughs> I was like, oh. Hello, can anyone out there hear me? Oh my god, that's funny. Oh, come on! Come on, damn it! I should have investigated the body. What the hell is that? What the hell? What is going on? The power of Christ compel you. No. <laughs> oh. Oh, he is not coming back for a sequel. I like this game. <laughs> Wait, why'd you shoot your gun? Um, so there was this little kid that I was hearing, right? Right. I think, I, I'm thinking it was my character's kid. Right. Um, the guy inside this, like, gun lock, gun safe thing. I, and, uh, I shot it. Then I opened it, and then he went from like walking dead zombie and like decayed all of a sudden. Then I had like a heart attack, and then he got out and ran away. Oh. Yeah. Well, on my side, when I lost you, I went to a room and I just see you just saying, Charlie, like you're dying. And it gave me yeah, a you went on my screen. Yeah, it gave me a choice to either investigate the body or hide. I didn't trust your answer, so I just went to go hide. Oh. And I found like a little safe thing. Yeah, I shot that up. Was that from the exorcist, that little thing? I think that was from the ring. I wasn't oh. talking too loud. Hope this isn't copyrighted music. <laughs> Probably not, it's in the game. Yeah, I was gonna say. Shit, this is the body. A lot of mistakes were made. Well, that got real bright. <laughs> Hello. 
Welcome to my repository. I am the curator, the curator of stories. Stories of love and hate. So you got me killed. And beauty, life, and death. I, I died too, I think. <laughs> I'm here to record the story you choose to tell. You see, this tale is only part written, and the choices you make will complete it and determine whether the lives of those with whom you are interfering continue to flourish or whether they are snuffed out. Hmm. You see, we each make decisions according to our own moral compass. And we have to live with those decisions, or die by them. But you shouldn't fear death. It is, after all, inevitable. It is the tax one pays for having lived, and it comes, eventually, to everybody. Still, none of us want for it to come too soon, do we? Apparently... Sometimes you will be determining a story together, sometimes separately. What one does may not make complete sense to the other because we all have different perspectives. But as in life, the actions you take matter. The choices you make will affect each other. I'll be keeping a close eye on your progress. It's not my place to interfere, but I might be persuaded to offer the occasional hint. Here's one for free. There are pictures in this world that can show you some possible futures. If you oh. can find them and study them, they may just help you to make better decisions. Or should I say, decisions that result in the outcomes you would prefer. Mm. That's all for the moment. Mm. We'll talk again soon enough. We'll have the opportunity to account for all the actions that you've taken. Or whatever mess you've made. And to study the photo. <laughs> I I can already tell I'm gonna sit there, I'm gonna overthink it. You're just gonna see random pictures that you think are a part of the hint, just like. Mm hmm. <laughs> So judging by his style of clothing, I assume we're somewhere in the early 50. Oh. I'm motivated. And insecure. Great. I'm just your brother. That's all it said to me. Oh. You're witty and innocent. Hey. <laughs> Think we got enough? If we run out, we can always call for backup. So, uh, look. I've never been down there before. Down? The water. Diving. Well, maybe you could show me how the pros do it. Dude, of course. Oh, that's yeah? cool. I'm, like, practically a dive master, man. But I gotta tell you, I'm tough. No special treatment. You gotta do exactly what I say. Cool. Well, cool. Thanks, man. Yeah, of course. You're my bro. <laughs> Whoa, careful. That dive cam is, like, super expensive. Look, bro, be cool. What? Julia and Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Uh... Tag along? Seriously? I thought I was invited. Brad, you're not on this trip because you're my bro. I mean, you are my brother, but I mean, like, we're buddies, you know? Um, kinda. I'm just out here to fucking hang, cool out, and kick it. What the fuck are you talking about? Let's just kick it and be legends, man. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm
amigo. Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry, I'm a little snappy. I'm just... The new medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing, Julia, it's been rough. <laughs> it's been like two weeks. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah. I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. Oh. Hey. So, uh, oh. Can I get your input on something? Yeah, what? Just, uh, kind of a big thing I'm trying to make a decision about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? I don't know what's the right thing to do. Hmm? Uh... You sure you're ready? Give it some thought. Consider all the permutations. Hmm. Hey! Hmm. Connie, this is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? Conrad. <laughs> Watch it, sis. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way, my little bro. Hey. Bradley! <laughs> Feel like no, I this is already you inaccurate. So You're yet. younger than me. Yeah, uh, likewise. Yeah, you know, it's fine. <laughs> hey, man. Want to crack a cold one with me? Oh, sweet. Crack a cold one with a boy. Yeah. yeah, cool. Yeah. Oh. Tight. Uh, I, l I love beer. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> right on, Radical. I like the cut of your ship. It's jib. Don't Holy fuck, I couldn't break my back anymore. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that you like That's just out of nowhere. <laughs> I'm done with this game, I swear. Where's the old crust bucket skipper? Anyway? Uh, impatient. I don't trust this. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but, uh... So is everybody on board and ready to go? Odie not liking her a whole lot. I know. So the game wasn't worth it? It's a character in the game, dog. Uh, That's a waste of a beer. <laughs> That's it, get it all out. Uh, yeah. <sighs> You, uh, wanna go lie down? Yeah. You know, maybe I should. Yeah. Oh, boy. Let's see those hot picks. What about over here? Hmm. your eyes on this uh oh Brad's calculations were right on the money always bet on Brad yeah, kids a whiz 
We should thank him. Bliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Oh. Wait. Are you saying we shouldn't dive? The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine. As long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. <laughs> well, I just can't you wait can't to see one down there. Can you imagine? Untouched? We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. Righto. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. Mm, where's he even at, though? Hey, hey. Hey, sweetie. Really here? Hmm. What's up? How you doing? Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. Hey, all part of the adventure. Sorry for putting a damper on things. No worries, dude. It was more than that, just a screw up trip. Just get some rest. Come back when you're feeling better. Ah, binoculars. Wait, 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 no, 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 no. I saw something. Go back. Go back. What in the... Oh? Huh. What am I looking at here? Hmm, that's all I found here. But I... Hmm... Okay, that's an interesting premonition. Hey, sis. Mm-hmm. Hey, Connie, how's it going? Hmm... Oh, work, work, work. I thought we came on this trip for relaxing okay. to the max. You've never worked a day in your life. Not Excuse a whole me. lot of information that was needed, I, I think. Work, but and hardly working. Yeah, you should see how these rebreathers work if you're planning on diving tomorrow. Blah, blah, blah. Whatever. <laughs> Gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. Can you get out of my cutscene? Uh, sorry. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, I just we see you walking around. Come out here in the middle of nowhere to do whatever the hell we want just, without don't any mind me. Down our neck. <laughs> That's the good old American way. I'm serious, Connie. All right, I'm gonna get these rebreathers set up, and then oh, we'll do the final steps together. Great. I'm gonna kick back and uh, enjoy the sights for a little while. And by enjoy the sights, I mean I'm gonna ogle our captain like a grade A creep. Yeah, I got it. Gross. Hey, at least I'm honest. Still gross. Okay, I don't think that provided me any useful response. information. Hmm. The pulley. The fuck? Need an extra hand? Never used a rebreather before. I think we're in good shape. Oh. Probably not a bad idea for you to have a clue how these things work. Gotta say, not too happy. Well, with hello. What's this? Well, that didn't leave me much. Rules are rules. I get it. But what's the big deal if nobody finds out? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. All right, I'm gonna get these rebreathers set up, and then we'll go through the final steps together. 
How you feeling? I shouldn't have had that beer. No sweat, Braddy Shack. We'd be hanging up top. Should you care to join? <laughs> yeah, I'll be up as soon as I... <clears throat> Stop puke-heaving. Wow. I can't yeah, understand. maybe turning it off wasn't probably the best idea, but you know it's... fine. What's back here? Oh, a fridge. More beer? Hello, locker. What you got inside of you? I don't know, am I supposed to be doing something here? What's this now? Oh, I saw a thing. Fancy. You're on you, Alex. Hmm. Okay. Oh, I bet you I'm gonna see that painting. It's not much in there. Hmm. Okay, that door is just locked. What if I have to use it? For all I know, that's the loo. Well, I guess there's nothing. Oh, wait. Out in the waters. Alright. Oh, Captain, my Captain. You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. Mother Draghi is the oh, psychic. Yeah. Sorry about that. My sis can be a little, uh, intense. Uh, that's one way to put it. There are laws here, and customs. You gotta Dude, respect that. Tanks are ready where these you rules are. are all pretty basic uh -oh. stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of what dives? What is this? Shroud of Innocence. Oh, I got experience. In all the right places. No, that's a yeah, lie. I oh, got it. well, that maybe. And I tossed it back. Anything else in here? You don't seem to give up easily, do you? No. For okay. all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. I don't know which one is best, to be honest. I'll just say nothing. <laughs> nothing to say. Well, blow me down. You know what? Fine. Conrad, give me a hand. Okay, so this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Okay, O2 check done. Beaver, you gotta check your O2 first. Uh. Looking good, Jay. I'd like to take you underwater. Hey, that's my sis you're talking about. <laughs> How you dare you? It? Oh, hey, guys. What? Jesus, why are you so loud? I almost completely forgot. When I was looking at the dive cam, I saw this Fucking huge God. hole in the tail. Kaboom. Fucking God. That's your way in. Fucking time. Oh. Thanks, work, man. Thanks, Conrad. Thanks for that, dog. Hey, you little Christ. Yeah, you're welcome. Let's see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Looking for a first mate, Captain? You need look no further. Oh, I should have taken the other one. You give up, do you? Are those two going in or what? Like, I know the wait is interminable. Oh, I can take soon. Things, thank goodness. Soon it'll just be you and me. Out of the frying pan. All right, Into the kids. Fire? Yeah, I heard that about Good you. to go. Ha ha. Just remember the God, dude. The they could just turn 80 in like the course of three games. I feel like she likes the confident me.
Oh, that's a hand. I thought that was seaweed. It's... <laughs> <laughs> that as soon as I get to a thing with stuff stops walking, looks like. I was gonna my leg cut. Can I to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you What's believe that? it? It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not waste any time not exploring. Mm. Oh, Hold on now. Is that... Well, that picture... That's ominous. Lucy's binoculars, is that... Well, if it's that same boat, we're gonna have some problems out here. Julia, leave it. Okay, I guess I can't even you see it. You have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Yeah, you're right. Maybe it is kind of dangerous. Oh, it's just open. Ooh. Hmm. Bullet holes. Hey, you found a secret. I fuselage. I did. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. Hmm. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? Let's see what else we can find. I don't like this. I don't like how I have to find secrets. Hmm. Good God. Yeah, I'm not so sure that he's ready. Oh. Oh. He's holding something. Moving in here. I'm just gonna pull out the same book. Wow. What the hell happened here? I'm gonna look at things. They knew they were goners. Okay, um. Is there anything over here? That the same no. thing? No. Pretty sure it is. Okay. Oh, wait, I can probably get Oh my fucking god. Let's check it out. I can. Oh, oh. I don't like the look of that. <laughs> hey. Oh. Okay, so. That's interesting to know. Oh! <laughs> Fuck you, eel. <laughs> you good? <sighs> yes, I'm good. Pilot and co pilot. This my loan? Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. 
Anything else over here? No. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the feeling it's gonna randomly just move a whole lot closer. Oh, Julia! Oh my god! Just don't touch anything else, no, please! I'm saying still. Alright, I'm uh, I'm gonna stop touching stuff now. Uh, what is this? Oh, whoops. I kind of nicely came back over here. Uh. I'm very worried about this. I had a premonition of this. Oh, uh, about what? At the stuff. Did I have to wait for you? Yeah. I feel like I had to because that's what happened last time. We gotta get out of here now. You almost lost a hand, buddy. Oh god, Alex! What happened? It's a gray reed shark. Not interested in us. Let's go. Ah, okay. God, this guy's such a douchebag. <laughs> Which one? Uh, Conrad. Oh, okay. oh. Something up with you, but it's it's not the best time. Yes, you're an idiot. Uh, on your brain, buddy. Nothing, nothing. Just kind of shaken up by a little brush with a gruesome and meaningless death. Uh, it doesn't matter. Let's get back up to the top. Hey. Seriously, what's going on? Nothing. Yeah, but you're freaking me out. Just forget it. Uh, oh, listen. God, that was cringy. Come on. We really gotta get up top. I don't like how this relationship thing Cliff, updates this is without telling me We're what happened. We're coming back up. Over. Hey, where'd that other boat come from? What the hell? <gasps> Wait, Julia. Gotta decompress you. Oh, you're an idiot. Oh, oh. my god. Fuck, we gotta get up there. Wait, How dumb can you be? <laughs> uh, oh, dude. Sorry, I'm sorry. My brother's up there. Uh oh. What happened? Fuck it, I'm going. Julia, I'm going with you. Yeah, you better be sorry. Why are you just why are you why are you just sitting right there? Man, he's so dumb, dude. I can't. Hey, what the hell is going on? Uh, hey JJ, don't worry about it. Oh good, he's with me. Uh, uh. Nothing. Yes. Your brother just took it upon himself to blow up my grill. Conrad, what is wrong with you? God damn it. What was up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. That's like a half truth. Right? What I want to know is when you guys <laughs> find, well, we found the plane and it is huge. Full of cool stuff. Unfortunately, we did not leave it as pristine as we could have. What? Why? The dive line, actually. How bad? Uh, there's no cockpit anymore, for starters. God. Well, that's just uh, fucking perfect. What did perfect. you do? Uh, don't worry about it. I'm quite worried about it. Uh, maybe I wanted to play a pilot. Who knows?
You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. And he, the love of hers. What about Conrad? A bold fellow, you might say. Or maybe yeah. you'd say arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss. Strong, forthright, stubborn. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms. So far, at least. Let me reassure you. You help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. And some I think they may regret. Oh. Alan? What? All my decisions were good. Really? I think. You shot my character. Okay, that one was not a choice. <laughs> How that was a point and plane. click. Pretty much what you'd expect. Brad, it was insane. It was like traveling shit. through time. No shit. Well, it was like traveling through time and accidentally ending up in a dimension where the past is underwater and like everything is covered in barnacles and sharks. Sharks? It was a gray reef. Ah. Hey, I thought it was pretty intense. Wasn't Comrade gonna get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. You fool. Me? Yeah. You let bring a bullet a bullet Alan, the vessel. You're like an open book with a few <laughs> I merely found it. <laughs> I can read you from a mile away. I, Something's up. I've just been a bit distracted by something. Julia. Uh, are you happy? Well, yeah, of that, course. I'm glad Why I know what anti air calorie I'm just <coughs> anxious about like our future. I'm not familiar <laughs> with that model. Yeah, That's neither nice. am I. What a rock of this dude. Lately, I've been wondering about the same thing. Where do we go from here? Oh, yeah, beers. <laughs> Look, when we get home, we can talk about some stuff, but... Relax. I mean, it's not like we're breaking up. It's just some stuff we gotta deal with. Okay. Yeah. This sucks. Stop. That, that's not, not the best time to tell a dude, you know, on a boat by. Okay. All right. Now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Oh, what's this? Hey, what? Let's just go with that. You're kind of preoccupied. No, I'm good. Sorry. Didn't realize I was spacing out. No, just that. Huh, that's adorable. So That's a stupid idea. Uh, yeah. It seemed a little too dangerous for my blood. Relax, Brad. How many times did I tell you not to be such a wuss? Uh, I'm gonna go find Julia. Hey, almost time for barbecuing. Got the pad yet? Sorry, I got distracted. No worries. Let's go get it. Uh, that's just the vibe I'm getting from the studios right there. Let's go up. Come here, you vixen. 
Oh. Oh, you dog. We should get back. Right here. Hey, well there, sailor. Um, excuse me? Careful. If you did decompress too fast, then you should go easy on the beer. Uh, Alex, I'm fine. I think if I got the bends, I would know by now. Not always. Sometimes the bends can be super delayed. It could be hours or a day or two. The bends? Yeah, it's uh, when you come up from a dive too fast. Oh, 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 yeah. Uh, uh, decompression sickness. <laughs> Nerd. Little nitrogen <laughs> bubbles that get stuck in your <laughs> hurts like a bitch. It's really serious. Divers get sick and die from decompression sickness every year. And that is why the good Dr. Conrad says drink them if you got them, because either you're fine or you're going to want a little something to ease. I don't like Julia, this dude, like, at I'm all. I'm telling you not to drink any alcohol right now. Oh, come on. Telling you? Take orders from this guy? Just drink a beer. Beat the living shit out of Conrad, dude. God. Uh, maybe I'll stick to H2O. Don't want to push my luck. Thank God. Alright, everyone. Check it out. It gave me a choice that I had to drink sure the beer too. Uh, I, I, I saw. He wants to find some sunken treasure. So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. Wow. You find anything else? This plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. Reckless. All of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. Then what? Superstition? Is that it? Really? The dead don't sleep well in these waters. May sound silly enough to you all, but I was raised on this shit, and it sticks. You're right. We should have been more careful. That's not me. I'm sorry. Why do I not believe okay. that? <laughs> Maybe. I don't know you. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. He's just They're trying to cool hit it. Ghost mm -hmm. stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? Uh. Uh. Well, so far with this character, I'm making him kind of like. Yeah, sure, but, you know. Nothing like what Fliss is talking about. Tell us a tale. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> what <laughs> should I choose? Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Scare away, little bro. Okay. Here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic That's what they sound. always say. Wait. Uh-huh. Where'd you hear this? Uh... <laughs> uh... Uh... If you need to know, it's ripped right from the rotting pages of the terrifying ancient in-flight magazine I was perusing on our way here. Ooh. A lighthouse <laughs> to the top and a tour, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. Oh. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid, and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. It's smooth. Mm -hmm. The woman asks, okay. I live here in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twists. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman Time becomes trouble. hysterical, and his sister parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. 
I mean, do people even use axes anymore? Uh, I'm just reporting the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets with an axe. You know, sometimes you have to embellish the facts a little to get at the deeper truth. It's okay. Okay, so who did it? Without the the one on the right doesn't even make any sense. The woman says, "It was my brother," and she turns to the closet and says, "He's hiding in there." Ah, oh, great. Blame the brother. So the lighthouse keeper creeps <laughs> over to the closet, opens the door, and sure enough, there's a man inside. But he's cut his own throat. Horrified, he looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. I'm expecting a jump scare. He sees. It's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> yeah, it's so ah, gross. Horrible. Hey, oh, super twist. Nice. I was about to call out, like, a Star it's Wars, and then that lightning kind of spooked me. <laughs> I was expecting a jump scare, so Where I was. Where are we going? Pretty cool. I think he told it better last time. A good effort. Yeah. Okay. Fuck you too. You all had your fun. We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh uh. No 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 no. Because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required one more beer before hitting the hay. Well, Who says that? Uh, it's standard issue regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following orders, man. <laughs> I'm into this website. <laughs> Ten four, good buddy. And I'm out. <laughs>